Hi everyone, this is Deep Single from Attack Point. Welcome to second part of the series and this series will be basically focused on how to patch all the drivers and how to make everything work so well and good as you might be facing graphics issue, sound issue, trackpad issue and all that issue because there is a lack of driver in your Lenovo F50 to work with the El Capitan. So this tutorial will be based on patching stuff. So this tutorial will need internet connection. You might have your iPhone to connect with your Lenovo Y50 via USB cable and turn on the hotspot or you may have the Ethernet connection Ethernet or you can share Ethernet with a via Ethernet port. This is the two best solution for now as you don't want to invest in inbuilt Wi-Fi card for such hack and tosh system. I would recommend inbuilt Wi-Fi cards to those who want all the capabilities of continuity and hands-off feature which iOS and Mac OS X brings on the latest version of EL Capital and iOS 9. If you don't care much about that then you just grab that dongle which is only $10 and that works perfectly fine. That one, I will recommend you to buy Adimax dongle which I suggested in previous video as well uh, and I did make a guide for it separately on how you can make it work on EL Capitan. So that costs only $10 and it is awesome device because it is so, so small and you won't be finding any difficulty in carrying it around with your Lenovo Y50. Once you get internet connection you just need to open terminal and copy paste the code which I am copying from the Tony Mac x86.com where you will find this you have to write get in which they will ask you to download the developer software which will be needed in patching the software and drivers so just uh, agree all the terms and condition and then the download will start to begin once you are download done it will going to install every developer tools which is needed in the patching of the drivers in Lenovo Y50. Once you're done with that, you just need to copy paste all the stuff which I'm copying right now from the site tonymacx86.com. All the links will be down in description below. Once you're done with that, you just need to do a couple of reboots and all that stuff. And this is how the thing works. As you can see, I'm just copying every code if you want to read those texts you can read but this is not much about it you have to just copy and paste all the things in terminal as it as it is as it is mentioned over there and you won't be finding any issue This video is dedicatedly made uh, for the full HD version because this this is the laptop which I am having right now. I don't have the UHD version so UHD version user may look around for some extra code patching and you just need to follow that uh, as it is as I am doing right now. Just have to copy paste those stuff and agreeing all the things. Once you're done with that you just need to final config the plus file which is done by this last command once you're done with that your Lenovo Y50 has been successfully patched with a 
proper driver as you can see the transparency and everything has been came back in my Lenovo F50 and every animation is smooth and good and my brightness and sound everything is working I did find that sound sometimes don't work if you your sound don't work you just don't need to worry about it you just need to open terminal and paste this code Once you're done with this, it will work going to ask the password and it will going to rebuild all the cache memory and all that stuff. Once you're done with that, you just need to reboot your system and then your sound will be back there. This is all about the second part of the series and I hope you guys like it. And in the third part, I will going to do some benchmark and all that kind of stuff. Give a thumbs up if you like this video. Thanks for watching.